Hi y'all, welcome back to my channel. My name is Lichelle. In this video, I'm going to be showing you a few things that I found in the Dollar Tree. Yes, the Dollar Tree. The Dollar Tree is known for having some home decor items. It's also known for you to get your personal items and anything that you may, you know, want. Anything that you may find in like a Walmart, a TJ Maxx or anything could possibly be in the Dollar Tree. So in this video, I am going to be giving you a tour of two or three of my Dollar Trees that's in my local area, which is Spumber, South Carolina. And then at the end of this video, I'm gonna show you exactly what I picked up.
Alrighty, I hope y'all enjoyed the tour of my local Dollar Tree. That was two different Dollar Trees. I don't know if you can tell, but I did go to two or three Dollar Trees and picked up a few items out of all three of them because they seem to have different things. The first one that I went to had almost like bare shelves. And then the second one, it had a little bit more, not too much home decor stuff, but it did have a lot of beauty products and things that you may want to use. And then the third one, I just went in there just to be going in there to see what they had because I was in that area. So the first thing that I picked up was I picked up these here nails. And with these nails, it comes in 12 a pack and they all are different sizes. So you do have to get two, um, you do have to get two boxes. So these are the nails. And I know I said that I wasn't going to purchase any more of these. But I decided I will go ahead and purchase these. These probably will be my last pair that I purchased. Um, these nails do tend to last about two to three days. After that, you're going to be taking them off and replacing them. So I like the print on them. So that's why I got them. So I got those. Another thing that I got is this charcoal uh, toothpaste. I have tried this one time before. And I absolutely loved it. And I actually went in the store to go purchase it in a bigger size. But I actually forgot the actual kind that I was supposed to get. So I went back in the Dollar Tree and found this one. So now I can take a picture of it and purchase a bigger one. And I actually think that this works pretty well. Next thing I got is I purchased some Olay body wash. Normally if I want to try some body wash out, I will go get a smaller bottle of it and try it out before I actually go purchase the bigger bottle. And I normally am a Dove person, but... Um, I do use Olay Moisturizing Body Conditioner, so I wanted to go ahead and try the Olay um, Body Wash as well, and this is the one that I purchased. I have already used it. It's okay, but will I purchase it again? Probably not, but I did purchase this Olay, so if you're an Olay person, please feel free. Stop by Dollar Tree and try this one out. Also, what I got is I found some e.l.f. products, and as you've seen in my video previous, that they did have some e.l.f. makeup that they actually had in my first Dollar Tree, and I did not even know that they had e.l.f. makeup, but I did um, find these e.l.f. masks. I purchased two of them. I probably should just purchase one until I try it out to see if I actually like it, but I did purchase this one here. This is what it looks like. And this is the back. Says y'all instructions on how to use it. And another thing that I purchased is something to buff my nails. I know you can probably tell that they're a little bit more shiny than normal. Um, they have broke a little bit, but they are a little bit more shiny than normal. And what helped me get to that result was this here buffer block. So it has four different stages. As you see, I already used it. But it has four different stages, and then that will make it is end up being you know shiny like that and then i also found this other face mask it's a clay mask in a gray color i decided that i would try that out so i'm gonna let's definitely see how that works and yeah and i got like two more beauty products and then it Another thing that I purchased is a pod foot file. Um, I have never purchased one of these before, but I have seen people use them. I decided that I will give it a try. And of course, you know, everything in the Dollar Tree is a dollar. So I will most definitely try this out for a dollar. And then I also seen the um, lashes in there. And I thought it was kind of cute. You know to be a dollar um i got two pair of them two different designs and this is one these are more like a natural kind you know more natural and then this one is more like pow <laughs> so yeah these here That is all of the beauty products that I purchased. Now we're going to move on to the home decor items that I purchased. And the first thing that I want to show you, I'm going to show you is two pieces to it that I'm going to get. So this I purchased to put my, um, like in my bathroom, I'm going to put like my perfumes and stuff on. 
but what i was actually looking at is a video that i seen on youtube where this lady added these beads to the bottom of them so what she did was she took four of these individual beads and placed them on the bottom and then she spray painted the whole entire thing into a color that she wanted um i want to per try to find like a rose gold if possible because I do have some items in my master bathroom that are rose gold. So I would prefer for this to be rose gold. And then, you know, also paint these rose gold as well. So I'm going, that's what I'm aiming for. So that's why I purchased this. And I can pretty much fit like all of my perfumes on here. Because I don't have that many. Oh, so I put all my perfumes on here. And then this will give it like a little height by adding four of these. And then I'll probably find something else to do with the rest of these. And that's all that, that is. Another thing that I found was this here wallpaper. So this is some peel and stick wallpaper. You can actually put this on your wall or if you would like to, um, they actually have some other areas that you can put it on. So you know how you have like little shelves that have like a little back board behind it. You can put it like on the back of it to give your shelves some extra design. Um, these, of course, was a dollar as well, and you just peel and stick, um, and they are removable. So I would most definitely try it out in one spot to see how easy it is to remove, especially if you plan on, like, reselling it or if it get damaged. Just see how easy it is to remove it from the wall. If it's going to damage your walls, you might not want to try it. But, um, yeah, just peel and stick, and it got the instructions on the back, and I just thought this was a cute design. I think it'll go good in like the washroom like when you walk into my washroom you have my um washer and dryer on this side with a shelf up above it and then it's just a wall over here so i'm thinking about just putting it on this wall over here and then having all the other walls you know just a plain color so yeah i thought this was cute oh and the size of this is 11 by 16 so i got a pretty decent stack of these and hope that will be enough we shall see then i also picked up this here fall stick i thought that it was cute um it's just you know something simple easy to put out there in the yard for the fall it probably will be you know a one-time use because it is the dollar tree and between you know the weather and all of that after the fall it's probably going to go in the trash and then you can just easily pick up one next year if you would like um and it does say family and friends and it has football on it so i thought that this is cute this is how long it is so we'll see how that looks out there and then the last but not least i don't know if it, in y'all local dollar tree if you've seen it but we have a five dollar section in our dollar tree it's a dollar tree why do we have a five dollar section i'm not sure but um i have seen these pumpkins on other people youtube but it has not been this big normally they've been like about this size you know a little bit smaller but i found this here pumpkin and i thought it was cute the stems look you know pretty and then the actual color is most definitely cute so i purchased this um i purchased two of them actually so i got two of these they both were five dollars a piece and i've seen these in like ross tj maxx target walmart i've seen these in a lot of other places and they range from like 7.99 8.99 10.99 so to get it for five dollars i thought that was a pretty good steal um pretty good quality for five dollars so yeah these is what i also purchased as well so yeah so those are all of the things that i purchased from the, my local dollar tree like i said i went into three dollar trees and just got a few things that i thought that i would like. <laughs>